Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make these insanely delicious and oh so satisfying carrot cake cookies. Complete with a thick cream cheese frosting. But you know what? There's no actual cream cheese needed for this recipe. You don't need any eggs, no oil, nope, not even any sugar. So let's get started. Alright guys. To start with these cookies, you're gonna need obviously some carrots. These are two big long carrots that have been peeled. I'm gonna roughly chop them and add them to a food processor with a cup of dried pineapple and some dried shredded coconuts. Here I have some dates. Now, I don't know if you already know this, but I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. Never buy dates that have already been pitted because they're never gonna be as soft and creamy as the whole dates with the pit still inside. Lastly, cinnamon and oat flour will be added, and this is all going to be pulsed together with some water until the dough's formed. Place these on a silicon or parchment lined baking sheet to whatever shape you like. Whatever shape you make these is exactly how they will bake without spreading. They're going to bake for 350 degrees Fahrenheit for around 15 to 20 minutes depending on how thick you made them. Now for the best part, in my opinion, that cream cheese frosting. Now this is two cups of cashews. They've been soaking in water overnight to soften them. I'm going to pull them with a third cup of pure maple syrup and a squeeze of lemon juice until it's nice and smooth and creamy. Once the cookies are ready, you're going to let them cool and add as much frosting as you like. These are not complete without some chopped up walnuts. These cookies, you guys, are so satisfying and they're extremely filling. Store these in the fridge for a week and enjoy it on your drive to work in the morning. You know that's exactly how I'm going to be eating one of these. If you guys enjoyed this recipe, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Leave your comments down below if you tried it out. And as usual, stay tuned for more quick and easy recipes, all of them always with a unique twist.